Oh, yeah. Woo, hold on a second, folks. Hold on a second. Let me stop this. What's good? It's your boy Dookie back again with Bane. Budget and new gear reviews that we get the best Bane for your tech dollars. Right behind me, you can see I got an edit going. Well, actually, a render. So we're going to get this out really quick. I'm about to go take the dog for a long walk. And I got some headphones I want to check out. All right, these are the BTS-3s from Blitz Wolf. Now make sure you check the description down below. I'm gonna leave links to these. It's also gonna be a code for you to save a little bit of money. But these come in from the company Blitz Wolf. Basically, they're your standard pair of active type headphones for you to wear out when you're working out, walking, running, or even just around the house, however you may feel. These are Bluetooth wireless. Let's pull up the specs here, see what's good. Bluetooth 4.1 with IPX5 waterproof. They can connect the two devices simultaneously. will give you about eight hours of listening time. You can use voice prompts and they have these bionic shark fin ear tips. <laughs> These were sent over by the good folks at Blitz Wolf. Currently, you can pick these up on Banggood for $23.99. And I gotta say, the reason these are out of the box because I already had them, I've been listening to them, I've been playing with them, seeing how they'd go. For a pair of $20 super budget headphones, these are gonna do you good, plain and simple. You know, I've never been the biggest fan of these headphones with this kind of fin that goes behind the ear, but it does come in handy when you're working out. These are kind of bulky, you know, they're kind of bulky right here on the body, but they do fit in your ears nicely. Excuse my big head. <laughs> but the fin is definitely built for when you're working out. Sweat in, especially with these being waterproof, you'll be good to go. Now, just from listening to them, let me. Okay, let's see. I'm bumping some uh, Kev Brown right now. Shout out to uh, Kev Brown, producer. Man, he's got a lot of dope joints. I've been rocking with his stuff for years. Yeah. Hey, what can I say? For $20, they don't sound terrible. They sound pretty good. They have a solid little thump, little kick in it, trying to hit it, have a little, trying to have a little punch with the bass, the highs can be kind of annoying. They're not the best highs. Like, look, you're not gonna get super audio file quality, but I wouldn't mind keeping these in your gym bag. Maybe if you got another pair that battery isn't that good or whatever, you got these on backup, or if you keep breaking them, running them, losing them, these would be a perfect pair that you could keep. Now they also sent over another pair. I had to get those up out of here. These are the ANC ones. These have built-in active noise canceling. Now this is what the box looks like on the first one. It, it was exactly the same. It doesn't tell you too much. You get a few little specs here on the back. It has approximately, it says it takes about two hours to charge. Uh, standby time, 240 hours. You know that's not real. Uh, operation range, you should get about five to seven hours listening to music. So make sure you take that into account. Now this doesn't say anything about any type of waterproofing, but let's just open it up and see what's good. Okay, you get another little box. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention on the first one, you do get a little carrying case with some Blitz Wolf, you know, logo right here across the top. I know they got it. all these companies get this from the same manufacturer. Okay, I definitely like this case a little bit more. These are the active noise canceling headphones. Right now I'm being good. They're going about 450 bucks. But like I said, check the links in the description down below. You can get you a discount, save a little bit on that. So let's just open these up. I haven't looked at these. So this is gonna be my first time seeing it with you. Let's open it up. Okay. Let's see, we got the headphones right there. Let me say that for last. You got a micro USB. Get a couple more ear tips. Well, let's see some wings in here. Nothing special, we're not gonna open this and waste any time. I right, pull these open. Wow, these definitely feel substantial. There you go, these feel substantial. Can you see that right there? Can you see that right there, a little Blitz Wolf? It's got a little clip. <laughs> well, I haven't seen one of these with the clip in a long time, but let's undo these. 
Okay, now these feel nice. These definitely, you got this nice braided cable, got a little bit of metal to it. These are definitely more the type of earbuds I like to use. Okay, here on your clip is where your controls are. Right here on this side is where you plug in your USB cable and you have an LED. Uh, let's see, oh, on the back, oh, that's cool, on the back here, you have your forward and back pause play. You got all your buttons right here on the back. It may be kind of hard for you guys to see, but this nice little material, you got the clip. So let's just uh, turn these on. Let me see, because there's like an infinity button in the middle. Let's see if that turns it on. Ah, it does, that turns it on. There's your LED up here on the side. I don't know what this button is for. All right, uh, that might be the active noise canceling button. Right here is in pairing mode. Let's pull my phone up, see if I can pair to it real quick. Three days later. All right, finally, I had to turn the Bluetooth off on my phone, turn this back off and then back on. It was just too much. Let's go ahead and plug this in. Let's see. Got them plugged in. It's a little bit of humming. I don't know what that was. Every time I press a button or change something on my phone, there's like an audible hiss, like a little... Let's just turn the same beats on that I was listening to and see what's good. Okay. Let's turn it up some. I was right about this button. This button is the active noise canceling. You can actually hear the difference with the headphone with no music playing. So, let's see. Wow, that's pretty interesting. Okay, let me get these out of my head. That was pretty weird. I will say this. All right, folks, I had to jump in here right quick. I had to tell you something. I actually took these out for the day and used them after I recorded the initial part of the video. Now, I'd used these for a couple days and these were pretty cool. Solid, solid bang for like 20 bucks. Using these all day, these the ANC ones. Let me open them up. Yeah, these are the ANC ones. We got the charging on the side. We got the active noise canceling button on the back here. You got your multi-function button. I don't know if you'll be able to tell that. Okay, yeah, these function as volume up and down. That's your multi-function button. For the price, 50 something dollars, there's some things I like and there's some things I don't. These didn't fit in my head the best. I just couldn't get a, bit, a, a good enough fit. I mean, they stayed in there pretty much, but it just, wasn't the greatest fit, didn't have the greatest feel. Sound wise, it actually sounded pretty good. Now, I was in a training with about 200 something people all in one large room during a break. There's a lot of talking, people, you know, chit chatting, hanging around. Turned the active noise canceling on and it didn't disappear. The, the, the noise didn't disappear, but you could hear it getting lower. Then you turn your music on and you have more of that isolated feel that you will hope when you're, you know, when you get that active noise canceling. I think these will probably be the headphones that I use if I'm needing a cable or something like that going forward, just because I do like the active noise cancellation features and it sounded pretty good. I listened to a mixture of like hip hop, some podcasts, beats, all types of stuff. And it sounded pretty good. You get a nice, low end, pretty, pretty sensible, clean mids. Highs were not too annoying. So, you know, like I said, for about, for the price to have all of that is not bad. Now considering that they got Bluetooth 4.1, aptX, you can connect them to multiple devices at one time. You get seven hours of playback. They're IPX4 waterproof and splash proof. So, you know, while you're working out, sweating and things like that, you should be good to go. They are not bad. Like I said, check the links down below. You could get a deal on these if you order them from Banggood with my links and my code. I'm gonna put all that down in the information below. Let me know what y'all rocking out to, what headphones you wearing. It's your Kenfo Dookie. I'm gonna get up out of here. Make sure you holler at your boy.